Well, parking could be harder to come by this summer at a popular Rhode Island beach. That's because a threatened species of bird has decided to set up a nest right in the middle of the parking lot. We first told you about it on Eyewitness News at 6. Eyewitness News reporter Sheena Loshudo joins us now with the new details. Sheena? Well, Shannon, officials discovered this nest last week. An environmental group say while it will cause some headaches for beachgoers, it's important to understand this protection is vital. And we're hoping that that um, that plover flow traffic isn't too bad. A lot of us here in the Ocean State find ourselves saying we're going to spend all summer at the beach. A pair of piping plovers had the same thought. So we hope that longtime beachgoers here at Roger Real Estate Beach will understand and have patience. About a week ago, officials discovered this, a nest in the parking lot. Because piping plovers are a threatened species, the Department of Environmental Management, along with the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service, are doing whatever it takes to protect the two birds and the four eggs. We want to provide every, every opportunity for success. In this case, it means blocking off nearly 50 parking spaces at Roger Wheeler State Beach. The area is closed to the public. Birds need that distance. They need 50 feet clear on each side. DEM officials say they are very hopeful the chicks will survive. We're going to have monitoring every day. In the meantime, we've done some advanced preparation. Volunteers have even set up a path for the birds to take to the beach if and when they hatch. And the fact that on the whole Atlantic coast, there are only 2,000 pairs of piping plover, so 4,000 birds. And two of them decided to, to park themselves right here. So it's kind of, uh, it's kind of exciting. The DEM says volunteers will be helping you out and directing traffic until the area is cleared. And there is no exact date on when that will be, but officials believe the eggs will hatch within a month. I'm Sheena Loshudo, Eyewitness News.